Hey, um, just so you know, this is, this is not my phone. Do you I, know where your wife is? Uh, like I said, this is not my phone. I'm at the bus stop in, um... I know exactly who I'm talking to, Brandon. Do you know where your wife is? Um... She's been at home. Sure about that? Do not hang up on me again. Who is this? Leave your bag and throw your phone away. Of course I'm watching you. Put your phone in the bin. If you don't do exactly as I say, you won't see her again. Do you understand? Yes, yes, I understand. Head to the university. Which university, man? Your old university, Brandon. How does it feel to be so utterly helpless to protect someone you love? Can you feel the despair, the lump in your throat, tears burning in your eyes? Why are you doing this? How much does Kim know about your past? I'm guessing not much. We all have a wild past. Well, if that's true, then why not tell her? The thing I want to know is, where do you draw the line between wild and perverted or depraved? You know exactly what I'm talking about, don't you? I don't, I, I don't, I really don't. Stop. Boys will be boys. That's just how colleges are, right? But did you ever consider how you affected the girls? They were only young too. It's something they have to carry with them forever. So while you get to chalk it up to your wild youth, not everyone can shoulder that burden. It can become too much to bear. That's how I lost her. I'm sorry. I really am sorry. I did some dumb things. Bad. Bad things. But Kim, she's done nothing wrong. Neither did those girls. The toilet block. Goodbye, Brandon. <laughs>